Welcome back, Crusaders, to more Crusader. Music is badass, ain't it? <laughs> I was doing a little uh, research on Crusader and uh, reminiscing on the fact that I thought it was very, very uh, similar to the Ultima 8 Pagan game as far as movement, and lo and behold, it uses the same exact engine. This is the Ultima 8 Pagan Engine. It makes total sense to me now. Resistance can't afford any more allies like you, Silencer. I'm watching you. And I'm waiting. I can be real patient when I have to be. And I'll wait till hell freezes over to catch you son us out. That's a promise. She wants to fuck me, I can tell. Let me go ahead, I'm just gonna bump the music. Oh, yeah, music. Just a little bit. Limit last off digital for okay. Let's make sure it's optimal. I was watching some of the earlier videos, you'll notice the quality got better and better uh, as the videos got later. I didn't realize that the text would show up so small. I usually upload my DOSBox games in the original 640 by 480 resolution or 600 640 by 400. Depends on the game screen itself. Uh, so that's why it's a bit, uh, you know, grainy or whatever you want to call it. The text isn't that readable. Uh, then I decided to push it through as an 800 by 600 upload, uh, and that made it better. And then I remembered when I played Fallout Tactics, I had to go all the way to 1024 by 768 and upload at that resolution. So I think from now on, I'm just going to upload all my uh, DOS games that I play through DOSBox and, and re record with Camstasia. I'm going to upload them as 1024 by 768 to give you the finest quality and sharpness uh, that we can get out of it. I don't usually watch or play DOS games in full screen, uh, especially on a 27 inch or a 30 inch monitor. Uh, just, uh, <laughs> it'll look like shit A and B, that's not how I remember it. So I prefer playing on the smaller windows. I used to have, I think I started out on a 14 inch VGA monitor. So, mm. Oh, Captain, 14 or 15 nice inches. 14 or 15 was, that was huge back in the I've day. I've got a few toys today that just might suit your fancy. I got into computer gaming fact, before I, sound I, I cards were even invented. Very beautiful things, beautiful things. I always say it pays to stock only the finest of wares. Long before Windows like 3, Windows, Windows even existed, there. actually. I've got the best deals aside of the WEC Stock Exchange as well. Care to have a look? Have a look, have a look, have a look. <laughs> back when DOS ruled. And there was actually another Windows type program called called Quick Menu. I don't know if any of you others have are familiar with it, but this program you could draw and create your own icons, and it was basically my first version of Windows. Um, it was you know GUI driven, and you could create shortcuts. And me and my buddies, we all had our own little uh, handmade icons for our games to launch. But Quick Menu was it was the shit back in the day. It basically launched your DOS applications in a in a Windows environment. And this even was before Windows 3.11 came out. I also was doing more research on Crusader and I found out that you can actually get this GL303 uh, on the first level. There's a bunch of secrets in Crusader. And I, uh, not only did I miss the shotgun on my second playthrough, but apparently you can get this weapon on the first level. So. Sorry about that, but I've missed uh, you know all the secrets thus far. I've been trying to uh, focus on the gameplay and such. I need to look up what some of these do because I'm not sure. But anyways, we want to save up for uh, that rocket launcher or grenade launcher rather.
Ya bien. Starting mission five here. General Maxis assures me that you're the one for this job, Captain. Our recent troubles have prompted General Maxis and I to keep this assignment secret. It's a solo job. Only you will know the true objective of your mission. Recently, it has come to our attention that the WEC has developed a new encryption chip called Cypher. All our attempts as of yet to decipher communiques encoded by this chip have met with failure. However, intelligence has located the scientific institute where the WEC manufactured these chips. One of our operatives will provide you with an access card to gain entry into the fabrication area. You are to locate the plans for the cipher chip and upload them to Corporal Reeves whom I shall be personally standing over to keep his insatiable curiosity at bay. Once we have the plans, we will set up an extraction point. As always, if you have any further questions, consult your data link. Dismissed. In case you're wondering uh, where are all the, all the videos today, well, I shot about seven videos of Neverwinter Nights starting from this morning. I was up at 6.30 a.m. Uh, started LPing at 6.30 in the morning and of course I ran into some real life issues as the day progressed but I got about seven videos that are rendering and I'm just going to upload them when they're all finished. So look forward to seven videos of Neverwinter Nights at least from today. Some more Crusader and then Monday I'm going to do a slew of Baldur's Gate. Hopefully seven to ten videos of that. And that'll most likely be rendered and uploaded uh, throughout Tuesday while I work. I'll render and upload the shit. There are 15 missions total. So after this, we'll be a third of the way through. See, you go through those bullets quite quickly. Steam your ass now that you're already dead. coming out in black now. better weapons after this. I'm gonna 
do on a quick save. And we'll leave that other save open in case I need to get back to base and get a better weapon. Ah! But I can't do him. That's the dumbest shit I've ever seen. Ugh. Quick load. I'm not even gonna accept that. See the guards are getting a little bit more elite. Oh, I just crushed that fucker! Yeah! Crushed him with an elevator, that was sweet. Oh shit. Where did that guy go? Dr. Watson, since we no longer have produced the 3718 chip at the Smile Memorial Science Center, you can expect to receive the remaining chips full meltdown this afternoon. See that no chips find their way out of your facility. Oh, post. Stop right there. Ah! Oh! There don't work for you, bitch. Ow! I dare you to run under that. Oh, crush your ass, motherfucker! Welcome to the ghetto!
Game key card from Rebel Informant. Locate the MILF computer in the science wing, level 5, and download the cipher chip pads. Easy as goblin pie. A crusader bitch! I'm just gonna leave these med packs on the floor in case I end up needing them later. Got me a key card. The WEC network is fucked up. Please, shit, fuck. All right. I like those clips. Go ahead and fill me up on those. Ah, bitch, your mama ain't authorized. But I let her anyway. Drop it. Come on. Come around the corner. So I can say in my Robocop voice, drop it. Dead or alive, creep. You're coming with me. Piece of shit fucking robot ruined everything. Goddamn little motherfucker.
help. So I can't get a spot in my path.
All right, well, I'm getting a steady amount of ammunition for this gun now. And some. Checking, making sure there's no key card. Better safe than sorry. Sucks I can't hold more than 10 batteries. Security! I'll take that. And I'll see you next episode, folks, with more okay. Crusader.